Welcome back ladies and gents, welcome back to another video on the channel. So today we are going to be looking at streamcd.net. Um, it's a website which is free, uh, or as far as I've noticed, free uh, widgets for your stream. Quite handy ones, uh, one a bit like, let me go like that one just there. Or your YouTuber subscriber goal and stuff like that, especially when you are streaming as well. And it updates live as far as I've seen. Um, I tested it with an account. I subscribed anyway, and we resubscribed, and it showed it worked. So let's get into it. Let's show you the website, ladies and gents. I'm just going to that one. There we go. So here we are. There's the website. It has got a few other bits as well. Um, so streamcd.net. You will have to log in and create an account. Oh, create an account. Then you can log in. Obviously, uh, I I have done that already. Um. Once you create an account, it will ask you to confirm your email, all that jazz. So there's a couple of bits I I quite like about it. There's the uh, YouTube like gold that's in here, no, here, here, there, or ever. Um, YouTube subscriber goal. This is the one where I quite liked it. So when you set it up, so we'll just set up a new goal. So say we want. Let's go. Oh, I didn't cut. So the the actual channel ID, what you will need, um, like the wrong thing, is the ID down here. You need that twenty four uh, character one there. Um, and then you can paste that into there. So mine's already up there. Let's go. Uh, oh, hang on. What have I done there? Uh, it's already registered. Oh, that's be why. But if you hadn't, that'll be where it is. Um, it's it's quite a good run, and it, like I say, it updates um, it's pretty instantly. Uh, well, I'm not a bit a bit a bit, <laughs> bit bit much, but um, it's quite a good one. So once you've got it done, and and you can view the you can view the source, copy the URL, and then you can just paste it into uh, OBS as a browser source. Um, I think you just have to adjust the quality browser. Now, we, we just do that like we do with any other browser source. Uh, as you can see, let's just... Locked off, there we go. So there you go. It's all there as another browser source. Just press OK. And there you go. Place it wherever you like on your stream. That's one widget you can do. I know if somebody like me who wants to push... I'm pushing for a YouTube partner, as we all know. Um, this this will be quite a good addition to any stream. Yeah? Um, next one we've got is uh, the other one I do quite like on this is a countdown timer or timer tools for live stream. So we can set up. Uh, um, so I'll do one for my birthday. My birthday's coming up. Let's go. So this one do it we just need to edit the element sometimes it does take a while to get in but it hasn't on this occasion so we're going to go for this one you can actually have a uh counter uh, minutes countdown time one thing i would say with this if you want to have to keep editing this one um to do it each time it's a little bit much so i would suggest some of the 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 lure scripts that i've done videos on in the past they're a little bit more easier to to get to and you have to come to the website anymore but for long-term timer goals this is one i was quite interested in so me my birthday is 21st of second 2022 we'll do it at midnight so close to midnight can um and there you go it gives you your time uh the the, the days the hours the minutes the seconds it's already counting down um you can do a layout setting so you can take off so Bit, so you want to take out the days but i don't know want to i'm going to show take out the labels i don't know why you want so you can take off the seconds too bad minutes rest of it i would say you need to keep on fonts uh i think so uh, top title uh time of uh, digital they're all they're, they haven't actually got any other fonts so testing it out Oh, there is other ones. Ah, oh, my mistake. I got that wrong. Um, this is how wrong I. Uh, 
So you can, you can select different fonts. Go. Oh, see, so search for font. There you go. I've learned something new there as well. Uh, uh, there. Uh, oh, there you go. So you can adjust the fonts as well. I I, I was wrong there, obviously. Um, and the other bit you can change is the colour. Change the colour of the top title. I'm going to do red, actually. Put it on. Leave it a black for that. And the label. Really stand out on this. There you go. Yellow stands out. And then once you've got that, again, it's just a matter of. There you go. Birthday one. And just copying that URL. Um, go into OBS. In another browser. So whatever you want control v the will i will say the width i found i had to go something like 1200 on there you go simple then you can resize that however you want put it wherever you want on your stream and you can put a title to it call it your birthday countdown um and or for an event or something like that and that will never change that will never change um and obviously that and get hide it if you don't want it there on your stream but yeah it, it's a quite a good so quite a good thing for it i will say i have tried to do some of the raffles i haven't quite got my head around it yet why how and work obviously subscriber uh like goals i like i said i haven't really used so what is your goal Are you inserting a value URL? No, I haven't. <laughs> I don't know why. But you can, uh, another one, profiles. You can add a few other profile bits in here. So your YouTube, your, your Twitch, Twitter, Facebook, so on and so forth. Add them in and save them. Because I'm assuming been, some of it being beta, they're going to add me. But it's a quite quite a good, easy. Oh, hey, up. This is why you don't have stuff on hotkeys. In it. Oh. Anyway, we were zoomed in. <laughs> I didn't realise. I just get in the zone, talking away. Anyway, ladies and gents, that's um, I think that's probably going to be it for this video. Um, you get the idea of it. Um, it's quite a handy little tool to put a few widgets on your stream if you want them. Um, and then you could probably use things like the move, move transition filter and um, that plugin. Sorry to to make it pop on and off every now and again um stuff like that so uh right where are we going to put them today we're going to kind of try and aim for about here i think about here we're going to probably put the uh the playlist so go on click it click that playlist watch the playlist let's help get those views up as well <laughs> no anyway and subscribe will be somewhere around just subscribe anyway subscribe is down there and the like button's down there so smash that as well uh i'm waffling again Right, catch you all in a bit, ladies and gents. Peace out. Bye.